guys, Shadow here, and I'm bringing you another video. So let's get into it. This is going to be finding K6's stash, and it's on IO this week. So where you want to do is you want to spawn in at the rupture, just like so, and follow my lead exactly, and I'll show you where the chest is. So it's going to be around where the strike takes place, um, just over here to the right. You see that big opening right over there on the left side? We're gonna go over there. So we're gonna go there. Just heading over here. We're gonna go into this little nook and cranny just on this side. And here we go. Here is the first chest. See what we get. And we got some blue gear. All right, let's move on to the second chest. So for the second chest, you wanna spawn in at Giant's Scar. And this one's really close, it's right here, just to the left of it. But we're gonna hop on our Sparrow. And we're just gonna go right around the corner. This one you can't really miss, to be honest. And there it is, it's just up there. So we're just gonna float up here. And see what we get. And we got the Raman emblem and we got some blue mods and a letter fragment and some gear. All right, let's go on to the third chest. So we are going to be getting the third and the fourth chest right now. So you want to spawn in at the Lost Oasis, just like so. You're going to pop on your sparrow, and we're going to head off on an adventure. Now, the fifth chest, though, is kind of hidden off the map. And I'm going to show you that when we get to it, but I'm just letting you guys know that it will look like there's only four on the map right now, but there is still five. So we should be coming up to it, and here we go. It's right here on the left, and let's see what we pull. And we got some Legendary by Eververse. Awesome. So let's go on to the fourth chest. It'll be just right here, and it's on our left side. Let's see what we get. We got a weapon mod. All right, so let's go on to the fifth chest. So for the fifth chest, if you look around the map, you cannot see um, a marker, a, a spade, as you would call it. But if you go further down here, it's right here off the map. So you want to spawn in at the rupture and just follow me exactly uh, where I'm going. And it's right, it's an area that I haven't been to. So it's really cool that there's still something that's new in Destiny 2 that I can just go and look at and explore because I haven't been there yet. And we're going to go there right now. So you want to follow my, my directions or where I'm going right now. And there's this little nook and cranny right here. So we're going to follow it. We're going to come down here. We're going to go over this way to go up some stairs. We're going to make a left here. There's some st other stairs. Keep following it. Now, we are going to run into some Vex soon. So what I would suggest is just speed by. Uh, there are going to be some hobbies. And, okay, we got past that. Now, for right here, I would recommend getting off um, just because there's going to be a lot more stuff shooting at us, and the sparrows are very weak. And we can't make this jump. <laughs> unfortunately. So we're going to go this way and we're just going to float up over here and here is the fifth chest. Let's see what we get. And nothing. It was a dud. Well, thank you everyone for watching. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Comment down below if you want to see more Destiny 2 content and uh, subscribe if you're new to the channel and you want to see more content. Take it easy, Guardians. Shadow out.